has acquired French AI startup Dataka Lab, a company specialized in algorithm compression and embedded AI systems. The acquisition is expected to aid Apple in implementing on device AI tools for upcoming iPhone 16 models, which are set to be released in September. Apple is also set to launch its new operating system, iOS 18, during WWDC 2024. The company will offer large language model services exclusively through on device data processing. Dataka Lab established in 2016 focuses on low power, high efficiency, deep learning algorithms that can function without cloud based systems, aligning with Apple's commitment to user privacy, data security, and reliable performance. The acquisition took place on December 17, and while financial details remain unconfirmed, it is expected to be part of Apple's integration of AI in its devices. The Bong token, which has been experiencing market fluctuations due to internal governance and broader market conditions, has decided to execute a massive token burn to create scarcity and stabilize its market position. Token burning is a strategy used by many digital currencies to manage inflation and improve token economics. Bong Tao aims to make remaining tokens scarier and more valuable by reducing supply. Critics argue that such a drastic measure could introduce volatility and unpredictability in the token's value, potentially leading to unforeseen consequences on its liquidity and utility in the ecosystem. The Bong Dao and its community are likely to closely monitor the effects of this token burn and if successful, it could serve as a case study for other digital currencies considering similar strategies. The decision also set a precedent in the crypto community about how decentralized decision making can lead to significant community supported change in tokenomics. Australia now operates 1,002 Bitcoin ATMs, making it the third largest Bitcoin ATM network globally, with Canada and the US following closely behind. Australia makes up 2.7% of the total network, while the US hosts 82.8%. Australia may surpass Europe's 1,617 machines at the current rate of installation. However, security issues have been reported with a recent hack revealing the source code for El Salvador's Chivo Bitcoin ATMs. That's all in this bulletin for now. This is Mirch Sharma signing off. Do like, share and subscribe to 3.tv and for more information stories, log on to our website www3.tv.io or scan the QR code.